Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Make sure you subscribe down below if you have not done so already. I always forget to remind you guys that in case you're new. And I probably should do that. So make sure you subscribe and like this video if you enjoy. So today's gonna be a hard one for me because I'm going to declutter some makeup. Now makeup is really special to me. It's really important. It's my livelihood, it's my passion, everything you can imagine. I love it. So decluttering is so hard. It is so hard, but I just don't need this much. So today we're gonna focus on my blushes, lashes, which I don't have a lot of lashes, and like kind of like my everyday drawer, my foundations, bronzers, things like that. And I keep them in this drawer. Which, if you haven't seen my collection video or my collection series, I will try to link that in the description box below so you can go watch that video. But, okay, I can do this. I can totally do this, right? Oh, here we go. Let's see if I can, like, sit on the chair and then move y'all down a little bit. Hope y'all can see everything. Okay, so this is kind of like my organized chaos drawer. So I have some lashes from Punk Gal Glam, which I'm going to keep these. Let's see. I've got some blushes from Koki. I love these things. These are gorgeous and they're really affordable. So this one is BL755 Pink In. I know you can see the ring light. I'm sorry. Then BL752 Rose Glow, which these can double as bronzers. Then BL753, which is this one. I, I think I'm actually going to declutter this one because I've never used it and it's a little too dark. So I think I'm gonna actually get rid of this one. Another thing you guys, don't ask me to send you makeup. Don't ask me to send you the products that I don't use or that are lightly used. Or, no, I do a lot of giveaways where I give away new makeup, new, new makeup. And I kind of want to keep it that way where I give away new makeup, not makeup that I've used or anything like that because I did pay for every single thing in my drawers. So if I declutter something, I'm going to sell it on my Depop account and it's gonna be the way it is. So just just don't ask me to send you makeup because I have a lot of money invested in this and I would like to get some of that money back. And I do giveaways for new makeup for a reason. So yeah, love y'all, just, just, yeah. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Um, this is the Koki BL754 Dim Dimmer, Dimmer. Um, hmm. I'm going to keep this one because I do like this really light shade because it just doubles for like everything. Like you can use this, that shade to set eyeshadow primer. You can use it as blush, even a powder. So I'm going to keep that one. All right. So, decluttered one thing, which is actually more than I thought I would declutter. Uh, this Wet n Wild foundation. This one is the matte one. This is the like original one, and I am going to keep that. Obviously, keeping my Elf Poreless Primer. I mean, I use this all the time. It's one of my favorite primers. Keeping my brush cleaner, I take this traveling with me to clean my brushes, the Sephora cleaner. I just got these Punk Gal Glam Lashes, so I'm gonna keep them. They're really neat if I can open them. Which Punk Gal Glam, Punk Gal Glam is an indie brand, which if I can remember, I'll link them below, but I'm gonna keep these. Um, I'm almost out of this Benefit Hello Happy Foundation, so I am going to use this up and then repurchase it. So I'm going to keep this. I'm keeping my LA Girl Pro Matte Foundation. I've actually not 
even used this yet. I am going to do a first impressions of like drugstore makeup that like I haven't tried. So I'm saving that for that video. I'm going to keep my Koki translucent powder. Again, this is um, for that video. I haven't even opened it yet. So I am going to keep that. I'm going to keep my Park Avenue Princess Bronzer. This was given to me by one of my uh, subscribers and it's special, so I'm gonna keep it. And I do use it, I do use it. So. Keep my sponges. Okay, so this foundation, I'm going to keep it, but it wouldn't. it's not going to be a repurchase. Um, I really enjoyed this foundation. It has like a pump on it um, in the beginning when I first bought it, and now, I just can't do the smell. <laughs> do the, the smell. This is the Do You Full Coverage Fresh Glow Foundation. It is not full coverage at all whatsoever. Um, and the smell on this, like they say it smells like watermelon. I do not think it smells like watermelon. But I'm going to keep it. I'm going to use it up because it was very expensive. So I just have so, I just have mixed thoughts about this. There's just so many different things going through my mind when I see that foundation. I'm going to declutter this um, Maybelline Superstay Full Coverage Foundation. There's nothing wrong with it. I just got the wrong shade. I got shade 115 Ivory and that is not my shade at all. It's just, it's too dark. So I'm going to declutter this one. I'm also going to declutter this Lime Crime uh, blush, which I didn't think I would do, but I do not like this thing. It is very weird. It has a very weird um, texture and it doesn't show up. I have swatches on my hand. It just does not show up. Um, it, it doesn't blend. I just, I do not like this blush at all. It's got a weird texture consistency and I paid way too much. I paid way too much for it, so I don't need it. I'm gonna declutter it. I'm keeping my Makeup Revolution foundation. This is my favorite foundation. I love it to pieces. I've repurchased it a couple times, so I'm gonna keep that. I'm keeping this Too Faced Banana Cream uh, powder. I also really love this powder, and it's super cute. It's got little bananas, and it smells just like bananas. Uh, Love this for under the eyes. It is perfect for under the eyes. I've got two Anastasia blush trios. This one is in Cocktail Party. Ugh. And this one is in Pink Passion. So I'm gonna get rid of Cocktail Party and I'm gonna keep Pink Passion because I use this one way more than I use this one. So I'm going to declutter cocktail party. Yeah. I'm also going to declutter this Too Faced uh, Chocolate Soleil bronzer. I've had this forever and I've used it, but it's just so dark. I don't need this. And it's a little baby sample. So I'm just going to declutter that one. Try to smooth some stuff forward. Keeping this little mini hangover primer, I'm going to use it when I go to Florida in a month or two uh, for my little travel primer because it's just so easy to throw in a makeup bag. So I'm going to declutter this coconut water cream. I don't, I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> I don't use it. It's been in my drawer for a while and I got it in an Ipsy bag. So I just, I don't need this. I'm keeping my Becca powder. I love this powder. What shade is this? I think it's in the shade Fair. It is. It's in the shade Fair. It's the Multitasking Perfecting Powder. I love this little guy. I'm trying to use up the rest of this Wet n Wild Cover All Pressed Powder. Obviously, it's been used a lot, and I'm almost, almost done. So I'm going to keep this and use it up. I'm gonna keep the e.l.f. Beauty Shield. This is a setting spray. Oh, I love the smell of this. This is just such a nice setting spray. And it's not expensive at all. I think it's like eight bucks, maybe. For a setting spray, it's really good. So I'm gonna keep that. I'm going to be keeping the Koki Smooth and Glow Primer. 
I love this little thing. It's in a little squeezy tube and you just like squeeze it out in your face. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna keep this. Keeping my e.l.f. camo concealer. If you saw my e.l.f. video, you know that I love this concealer and I love the Dofa, so that is staying. As well as the e.l.f. pressed uh, powder, the Prime and Stay Finishing Powder. Love this. It's like $2 and I'm actually getting ready to hit pan on it. It is amazing. I love this. Definitely keeping, oopsies, my thingy went out. Battery's like freaking out. <laughs> I'm keeping my Farsali Unicorn Essence. This is amazing. I use this actually uh, before my primer. Oh, it's just so pretty. And it smells so good. I use this before my primer and I just really like the way it looks. So I'm going to be keeping that. Keeping my Kylie bronzer. This is like the only bronzer that matches me. <laughs> and I really do love it. So I'm keeping that. I am going to declutter this palette. This is uh, the e.l.f. What is this? E.l.f. Bronze Beauty. These shades, unfortunately, are just too dark for me, and I just don't use it for that reason. So I'm going to declutter this. I'm actually doing better than I thought. I'm proud of myself. But I'm going to keep this e.l.f. one. This, it just matches me a lot more. You get like two blushes, a highlighter, and a bronzer. It just matches a lot better, and this is the total face palette. So I'm going to keep this one got some little um, gems, crystal things that I use for like extravagant looks. So I'm going to keep that. Ooh. I'm keeping this Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour. Um, basically for this uh, powder, I really love this powder. The bronzer is just a tiny bit too dark. Nothing um, extravagant. But... It is a little bit too dark for my skin tone, but I can make it work, especially with this powder. So I'm going to keep this. This is going bye-bye. This is the Kylie Barely Legal Blush before she changed her packaging. And I can't stand this thing. There's no pigment. It doesn't work. I need to get these other swatches off my hand because I look ridiculous. But I'm decluttering this. Love you, Kylie. Love a lot of your products, but this one was not it, honey. I'm going to keep this Tarte bronzer in the shade Sensual. I haven't really used this all that much, but I need to break it out and use it because it is a beautiful blush. Oop, wrong pile. I need to go in the keep pile, Jamie. <laughs> We're getting there, y'all. We're getting there. Obviously keeping my Max Flix Plus. This is in the scent Rose, which I love. And I love the way they did the packaging on this. A lot better than when they did the other one. This one is in Lavender, but I like the wording and the like the font on this one more, but I'm keeping this one. I'm also keeping the Maybelline Fit Me in Matte and Poreless Powder in shade 100, also about to hit pan. Love these, highly recommend. Keeping the little baby uh, Benefit Professional. I take this when I travel, it's a cute little baby size, so keeping that. Also keeping this Koki uh, palette until I use it up. I know that these bronzer shades are a little bit too dark, but the whole top row is just really, really amazing. And so I keep this and I travel with it. Keeping these two little Clinique makeup removers, again, for traveling reasons, they go really well when I travel. So I keep those. This is a Lovecraft Beauty something. Oh, this was a blush, but it honestly is more of like a bronzer to me. I think I'm going to declutter this because I've used it once and haven't reached for it since. So I'm going to declutter that. Oh boy. Um, I got this as a birthday gift from Sephora. It's the little mini Kat Von D locket powder and Oh my God, I just have so many mixed feelings about that. It it works, but it doesn't. It's really weird. Uh, I'm gonna declutter it, I don't need it. Keeping this Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, one of my subscribers, whoopsies, gave it to me. Sentimental, special, keeping it. 
I'm gonna declutter this NARS little mini concealer. It is not my shade at all. It is way too dark. It's more of like a yellow toned, like mustardy color and the shade is mustard. So I'm going to get rid of this. I don't need it. I'm gonna keep both of these ColourPop concealers though. I have the white one and then I have shade Faro 2. I use these a lot. The white one I use um, mostly on my eye. I can't get it. Yeah, mostly on my eyes. Uh, it is very white. So I will put down like a shadow blended out or I'll put like a glitter on top of that because it's a, just a perfect white base. And then this is my actual shade of concealer. So I'm gonna keep both of these. I'm gonna keep this e.l.f. blush, love it. Same thing as like the powder. I just love the formula and like these little components. I'm keeping this. I'm gonna declutter this. I've never used it. It's a bigger version of the Chocolate Soleil and Medium Deep. I've never used it. I don't need it. I'm gonna probably put it on my Depop. I, yeah, I just don't need it. Um, this space case blush, I actually love this thing. I'm going to keep this. Um, you probably can't tell with my lighting. Maybe a little bit. I love this. I got it in a, a Ipsy bag and it's like the ColourPop Super Shock Shadows but in blush form and I love it. Is there anything else? Yeah. So that is it. Let me move y'all up. Hi guys. How's it going? So, I'm sure this is gonna like completely fall, but that's okay. Y'all can see my light, I'm sorry. So that is it for today's video. Um, I'm going to, woo, that like completely fell. Y'all didn't need to see that. It's okay, it's okay. We'll just not say anything. Just nobody breathe. Anyway, I'm gonna end this video before something crazy happens and we made it through an entire video without the cats knocking something over. So we'll just stick with mommy knocking something over. <laughs> that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the declutter. If you see anything that you'd like in this video, you can check my Depop because I'm gonna sell it. I'm, I don't, I'm not giving away makeup. That's what giveaways are for. So that's it. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.